freak out. <laughs> no kill me, Likey. Keep you in cabinet. Hello internet, welcome back to my channel. My name is Alex, otherwise known as Pugapillar across all my social platforms. Those things that just popped up there. That's me. Happy one year anniversary to one of the videos of 2022 that made me feel like I wanted to gag everywhere. The Texas Chainsaw Massacre. This month is Dirty January on my channel where I watch some of the dirtiest, grungiest movies. Texas Chainsaw Massacre made me feel absolutely horrendous. So I thought, why not do it again? However, this one wasn't released in 1904. Obviously what we're watching today is the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. This movie came out in 1904. I got a lot of comments about that. Directed once again by Tobe Hooper, uh, the Texas Chainsaw Massacre part two is, well, it's part two, isn't it? <laughs> Anyways, if you're new to my channel, hi, hello, how you going? Leave me a comment with if you own a chainsaw or not. Kind of concerning if you do, maybe, especially if you're from Texas. Make sure you subscribe if you want a buddy to watch movies with, to turn on the notification bell, leave a like on the video, please, it helps immensely. And if you want to see me talk a little bit more about this movie after I've finished watching it, or you want to see my videos a whole day early, or you even want to make a movie request, Patreon. Uh, that's, uh, that's what that is. Uh, yep. Oh shit, I completely forgot. I, w I watched the reboot last year on my channel, only just remembered it then. That was fucking dog shit, wasn't it? Anyways, the first one left me so traumatized, so why wait? Let's get into the second one. The only thing I'm hoping for is that Sally isn't in this and she's gone on to live a long, happy life and she lives till she's a hundred. <laughs> On the afternoon of August 18th, 1973. I don't want to read again. Chairs made of human skeletons. Then she sank into catatonia. Can we just admit, as fucked up as it is, that the human skeleton chairs were kind of cool? I have no idea where this is going to go, though. More Texans? More chainsaw? Like, what? where do you go with this? Not centering your credits text in the opener? I guess. If that fucking says saw, I'm gonna cry. Ch chain, Ch chain, saw. <laughs> well, this is a very different opening from the first one. The first one almost had me tasting my asshole through my mouth. This one's a. Looks like Austin Powers has arrived in Texas. We are on our way to the biggest party of the world. Yeah. <laughs> Groovy, baby, yeah! You're telling me that guy can actually see out those glasses. You can't see out novelty glasses. That's why they're called novelty glasses. Red River Rock and Roll Request Line, this is Stretch. What kind of name is Stretch? <laughs> I don't know, ask Mr. Fantastic. We are the road to Texas all you week in Dallas! <laughs> Mate, you are way too excited to be wearing those glasses. Yeah, later, Stretch. Just hang up, okay? You realize you have the ability to end the call as well. You work at a radio station. LG. Damn it, I'm trying, darling. Aren't you still on air? Shouldn't we shouldn't we not be saying these things? Who the fuck is at the radio station now? Wednesday Adams? Ah! It's night time and this dude's still wearing his fucking glasses. Is that your horn? We need to change that horn. Right, hurry up, get out of here! Oh my god! They gotta hang up. Actually, it might be a good idea if they don't hang- What the fuck is that? Is that a corpse? What the fuck is that? This is so different from the first already. Okay, dumbass, I have an idea. Step on the brake. Why are you still going the same pace as the car with the chainsaw guy on it? You guys are worrying about this too much, honestly. He's just giving you a free sunroof. Oh, and a free haircut. Oh shit, that's right through your head, never mind. Oh fuck, you split your head over. Oh my God. Sounds like they just had a head-off collision. <laughs> he became the glasses? This is just an accident. Just a couple of wild punks. Is that why there's chainsaw marks in the door and a dude missing fucking half his head? 
What the fuck? There was a moving house in the... What? Did Carl from Up forget to put the balloons on it? He's had to turn to automotive transport. I have authority from the DA's office to put you right back on the next plane to Amarillo. Well, I have a big hat. Put it in the press. Get it in the news. So this is where you go to the radio station who were taking the call and could hear the chainsaw going off in the back. So this is just this movie's version of Sally with bangs. You saw it. No, but I heard it. You can listen, it's here on tape. Jesus, that's a quick development. We're already, <laughs> we're already giving the evidence over. We gotta record all the call-ins. End of the night we wipe the tapes, but I kept this one. I might be the only believer you got, cause it's right here. Now this is evidence, sort of, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I would have pissed myself laughing if you went, no, that's not evidence. That's a tape. <laughs> I feel like I should just do the rest of this video in a Texan accent, but th that would kill my retention. Don't you get in my way. No, I'm already right in the middle of this. She's already in your apartment, dickhead. All right, I'm gonna stop. I got a perfect willingness to die. That gives me a moral on this bunch of mad dogs. They live on fear. They thrive on it. Can I just ask you, why do we have that light? Looks like a giant trumpet. What is that lighting up in your room? Oh my god, that looks incredible. That's lunch for like two weeks right there. Oh my god. <laughs> We're in Texas now, aren't we? Stand right up, stand right up. Come get some of this sweet ass chili. Gonna burn your throat and then burn your ass out later. He's Dallas's favorite caterer. I think he's kind of cute. Drayton Sawyer! Oh my god, that's my cousin! Oh, no, it's not. Oh, that's the guy. That's the petrol guy. He's not my cousin. No, and he doesn't make good chili. Got to tell the secret of that fabulously tasty chili. That's because it's got fucking human body parts in it. That's why it's tasty. I, I got a real good eye for prime meat. Yeah. Yeah, that's what it is. Mm. Runs in the family. <laughs> hey, dude, with how your family runs, no one should run in your family. This is Stretch, your fearless reporter, live from Dallas. This is just podcasting in the 80s. Cut right chainsaws. Well done. Well played. Cut right. Why did I stupidly think Leatherface would have ran this business? <laughs> oh, hell yeah. That's a chainsaw shop. Oh, I can smell the wood you'll be cutting with them later. Oh. What can I do you for? About $10. My wife's a bit more expensive. I don't even think that guy knows he runs the shop. Well, don't you want to test them? There's gas in them. There's gas in those cha- Why? Why are they filled with petrol? My man, you can't have running chainsaws in your store like that. You can't tell me that dude hasn't recently watched Star Wars. He's swinging that like it's a lightsaber. <laughs> Koala gun shop. Isn't this in Texas? I'm all the way up here to Burt Burnett. No shit. Any woman that has bangs, props to you. I don't think I could deal with little hairs hitting me in the eyeballs every two seconds. You can call me Stretch, Mr. Enright. Well, now you can call me Lefty. Stretch and Lefty. Two names that could easily be taken in a sexual manner. Her name being Stretch? Wonder what that means. His name being Lefty? Here's a special request we're doing this afternoon and tonight. Oh, this one's gonna go off the charts. Beyonce's not gonna know what hit her. What's on the radio? Ah, now don't bullshit me. All right, what station? <laughs> this ain't no joke, boy. My heart can't take it, dickhead. Oh, do you have a heart attack? Oh my god, I thought he had a heart attack. Those poor parents who had children in their cars who had to listen to that broadcast. Technically, she should actually lose her job now because you can't play shit like that on the radio. Sure got a lot of complaints, darling. Obviously. You think people are gonna ring up and be like, that was the best song I've heard in years. It's listed in the logs as a request. People complain about the request every night, right? Yeah, but that's just because you play ABBA every two hours. Not because you play a recording of someone getting brutally murdered. Oh, he's dead, isn't he? This guy's dead for sure. Okay, I'll go this is Stretch. Hello? Leatherface. Hello, Lefty? 
He's just too shy to make a request. Someone's playing with the LED lights. <laughs> They've changed them to red like this. Whoa! I'm like the radio station now. I actually kind of fuck with the lights being red, honestly. <laughs> it's kind of nice. I want to buy some uh, radio ad time. Who is this? So this is Radio Land, huh? The infinite turtle, the, the waves through the ether fuzz roll on forever. Roar! Is this movie trying to be more like a comedy than like sticking to its roots and being disturbing? Oh god, never mind, I've just seen this dude's mouth. Music is my life. Hell yeah, bro. Is that a coat hanger? Uh, now that we're here in, in flesh and blood. What are you doing with that coat hanger? Fishing for head lice? I've never been to a radio station before. <sighs> What is happening? I feel like I'm watching a dude on a TikTok live. Here's your tour. Here's a lamp. Yeah, lamp. <laughs> a lamp. Oh, rubber man. Uh, rubber rubber man. man. That's cool. Here's Mr. Shark. Oh, Mr. Shark. <laughs> oh, I like Mr. Shark. Here's some flowers. Here's a lamp. Oh, gee, you don't need to turn it on in front of my face. I like that we're meeting more of the family, but. Who the fuck is this guy? Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. <laughs> fuck, if that's how good that feels, I think I need to get out a coat hanger and give my head a scratch. Maybe his murder weapon is a coat hanger. Because we all know he's murdering his hairline currently. Hey, what's in here? Record vault. Oh, where you keep the golden oldies? Music. Fuck! Jesus Christ! I I swear to God, I almost just pissed myself. God damn it! Yeah, Leatherface still goofy as ever. Oh man, I don't think you're aware. He has a chainsaw. Get it, my plate! Ah, oh, my brain is burning. <laughs> Are you sure you're not Bizarro? Oh, you have no idea how much I just want to get my metal bottle and like ding it on his metal forehead. <laughs> Imagine the sound it would make. Oh, oh God, that was, that was disgusting. Don't pick your forehead. Stop, stop, stop. Hey, buddy, I don't know if you're aware all the walls are wood. Just go through one of them. I think she may have just realize she can't see past her eyes. Banana phone. Me fucking batteries flood! Why does my battery always die when I'm about to kill a woman? Inside your haunted head. What the fuck is this movie? I don't even think this movie knows what it wanted to be. I feel like they're going more the comedy route than just sticking to what worked. Anyways, LG is still here, so that's uh a little good. LG. Hey! He's a metalhead! <laughs> He's a metalhead! Lick my plate, you dog dick! <sighs> Jesus. Time for incoming mail! That's what I call heavy metal. Imagine you're just trying to listen to your favorite song in the car and you can just hear this fucking chainsaw interrupting it halfway through. Thank you! We discovered that there are other walls in this station. Not the soundproofing! Don't destroy that! <laughs> this guy's taking a beating from a hammer surprisingly well. Incoming mail! Yeah, we got it the first time. Why do you think it was unread? <laughs> Why are we murdering soda cans? It's like he's trying to fuck the ice with the chainsaw. Oh, that is always gonna be disgusting to look at. Dude has the same vocabulary range as my three month old daughter. Yep, <laughs> literally it just goes and that's it.
What are you thinking about right now? I don't want to know. Leave it in your head. Oh, he's about to murder that puss. Oh, please don't. No, please don't go there. Are you really? Really? No, 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 no. Oh, he's getting like a hard on too. He's licking his malformed lips. Okay, enough, enough. Oh my God, I just know he was so close then to... That right there, ladies and gentlemen, is a man with erectile dysfunction. This is how men act when it doesn't work properly. They will chainsaw down your radio station. Why are you trying to fuck with a chainsaw, sir? And why do I kind of want to buy a chainsaw just to like pretend to do that? She knew. <laughs> Nobody knows. <laughs> Look what you did to my plate, you bitch. <laughs> Got her? <laughs> Did you get her good? <laughs> 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 Giddy up! <laughs> kind of want someone to get a metal detector and run it across his forehead. <laughs> That's how you can actually find where they live. Just get a metal detector out, just hold it up and follow the beeps. Do we live in a castle now? Texas land. Oh! Oh my god, I was so close. Texas Battle Land. What does that mean? Just the locals all hate each other? Uh-oh. Oh. Who's that? Is that Drayton, the Chili King? Hey! Go back here! You gotta try some of my wood wind chili! Oh! Oh shit, what the- Whoa, whoa! We just got Valmid from Scooby-Doo! <laughs> Wait, that CG was terrible! Watch Valmid- She just floats! <laughs> Lefty, they came! Where were you? I don't know if they did, but Leatherface sure came. Oh god. <laughs> don't you cry, little sister, I'm here. Uh, don't you on, cry? You Do you realize she almost just got fucked by a chainsaw? Oh, that's giving me very strong Scary Movie 2 vibes of Grab my strong hand! Grab my strong hand! I got you! <laughs> yeah, same outcome, actually. <laughs> the slide. <laughs> Jesus Christ, not a very safe amusement park. I should not have given her a hand. Oh, fuck, that's right. He bought, like, three chainsaws. He's gonna have a chainsaw fight with Leatherface, isn't he? Based on the stupidity that is this movie, I would not be surprised if he has a fucking sword fight with, with Leatherface. That's, that's so goofy. Alright, we get it. You know how to yell. You don't need to run around like this. I get that this is an amusement park, but I feel like Lefty's feeling no amusement here. Oh god, that's disgusting. What is that, all organs and shit? I'm bringing it down! Down, down! I feel like you're gonna need a lot more than a chainsaw to bring the whole park down. You have more than one chainsaw, right? Why don't we dual wield the chainsaws and like spin around? <laughs> I'm jewel wielding chainsaws, goddammit! Oh, yuck. See, how many people do they kill a year? It feels like there's enough material there for 15 other Texas Chainsaw movies between the first one and the second one. Don't it. It's a mini chainsaw! Oh, I love this town! Hey, you nitwit back in here! Would you love this town as much if you didn't win Chili Champion two years in a row? Uh, whoa. <laughs> There's definitely something woeful going on here. It's not the chili. Hey, 
Hey babe, wake up! New Leatherface mask just dropped. <laughs> That's so disturbing. <laughs> A little bit of pee just trickled down my leg. No, no, no good. No good. No. <laughs> Speak like a caveman to him. I'm getting strong his into you vibes and I'm really not a fan of it. Help me. Please help me. Oh God, he's attracted to you. I guess it's a love story that works. Hey, you've got bangs and he's wearing someone else's face. No, 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 no. <laughs> You know it would be damp as well. <laughs> if he leans in for a kiss, I'm gonna vomit. I mean, at least you'd feel a little bit closer to your friend. Ah, fucking god damn it, he's into you! Oh, girlfriend, if you're not careful, he's gonna show you a different kind of meat. Oh, now he's tying you up and next thing you know, he's gonna throw you on a bed. Holy fuck, Alex. Do you know who- do you know what she reminds me of right now looking like that? The fucking thanks killing turkey. Oh my god, why? Why? The fucking turkey, really? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> How are you still alive? There's no way! There's no way that guy's still alive. Please say to her, you mind giving me my face back? <laughs> that's awesome prosthetics work though. Fuck, that's gross to look at, but damn, it looks good. Uh, LJ! They got you too! You didn't recognize you were wearing his face? This man has to sacrifice himself or something. There's no way he feels comfortable going out in public looking like that now. <sighs> Don't worry about it. It seems like a lot of people are having performance issues in this movie. Don't hug him, him. Don't, 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 push him away. <sighs> Shit. I'm dying without my face again. <sighs> Please do not put his face back on him. Oh, good as new. He may as well just stand back up again. Oh man, I would pay a million dollars to see him try to unlock his phone with Face ID. <laughs> just to see what happens. What the fuck? That's such a unique set. It feels like it's a haunted house, but it's actually haunted. Look what your brother's got now, you cool shit. You cut the main support and this is what happens. I would love to see this family just attend counseling, even for 30 minutes. I- I didn't jump then. Bring it all out! Bring it all out! Okay, have you been screaming that for the past 20 minutes? Where have you been? Just running around the amusement park? Bring it all down! Tear it all down! <laughs> Damn property taxes fuck up everything! That's not property taxes, man. That is a guy jewel wielding lightsabers. Like their chainsaws. Ah, fuck. The other way. The other way round. Oh god. Hide in the tube, hide in the tube. Fire the hole. Tube! Thank you. Get, get in there, stay in there. Fuck. No Shut up. This family gives me a headache. Bring it all down! Tear it all down! Holy fuck, that is disgusting to look at. Is that grandpa? Franklin. Oh, <gasps> no! That's Franklin? I almost didn't recognize him. He's lost so much weight. Don't you cry, my brother. I'm here now. I'm here now. They can't do this. Why'd they keep Franklin? Ah, oh, never mind. Everyone they kill is a trophy to them. See, literally trophies. God, imagine when the Leatherface family find out about PlayStation trophies and Platinums. They're gonna lose their mind. Leatherface's favorite game is gonna be medieval. <laughs> He's gonna Platinum it. Oh God, we're gonna run into the bad guys. <laughs> Why 
Why does he do this? What is that, man? It's like he's it's like he's mating call. It's like, hey, b hey, babe, wanna fuck? <laughs> You know it's all for show, Stretch. He's just doing it for affection. Let's talk about it! He doesn't know how to talk. Listen, this is not gonna work out. No, kill me, Likey. Let me go. Uh, oh. Keep trophy. Keep you in cabinet. Are you the saboteur that's fucking it's... up our house? Dad, it's my girlfriend. Bubba's got a girlfriend. Bubba's got a girlfriend. That look he gave them was like, you know how families are. S -E -X -S -S -X. Did you just misspell that? If you wanted to know about it, that's so bad. Why didn't you ask me? You want to know about it? No, no, no. Ask me. It's a swindle. I don't want to know anything about sex if it's coming from you, Drayton. You're already a king of spice in the chilly region. I don't need to know what spicy things happen in the bedroom. Burner like a rat. Finish her. Burner like a rat. Finish her now. Burner like a rat. Damn, she, I like it. Finish her now, Bubba. Finish her. Finish her. Dad, I can't. She was going to finish me later. You got one choice, boy. Sex or the saw? Sex. Jeez, that happened quick. That's what she said. But the saw, the saw is family. <laughs> the saw is family. <laughs> okay. What? And a two, and a three! Leatherface, mate, if you're interested in the lady, you gotta stand up for her. No! Oh no, we're not doing another dinner scene, are we? Please, 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 I can't do another dinner scene. Hurry it up! Grandpa likes to go fast. He always did. Come on! Come on! Time eats! Grandpa? Oh no, he's still around. God bless you. No, oh, no, keep Grandpa away because I feel like he's going to look scarier now. Nice to see Grandpa got an upgrade to the whip. Don't him like that, he it. looks like that Grandpa from Everybody Loves Raymond. Get the hammer. <laughs> awesome, Grandpa's going to do a hammer toss again. Right, let's, let's get on with it. Bingo! Do we have aim assist on that hammer? Because Grandpa missed like six of the seven shots in the first movie. doesn't want to. Let it go, please help me. Yeah, this will be what please you help want me. to get. Hard to top Sally's performance at the table in the first one, but she's doing a pretty good job. Help me, please. Oh, it just hurts my throat. Imagine screaming like that. You, your throat would just be killing you. Ah, uh, poor choice of words, Alex. Very poor choice. No, no, no. Oh, no. <laughs> oh great grandma. Great grandma in chainsaw heaven. Hey, grandpa, Bubba's got something to show you here. That actually looks like an old guy now rather than a dude just wearing prosthetics. <laughs> Come on, Jimmy. Remember those thieves? Come on. One hitter, Bubba. <laughs> That's uh two out of two shots missed there, grandpa. <laughs> three out of three. <laughs> four out of four. Five out. Your fucking track record is horrendous. That that's Palpatine right there. Palpatine with a big schnoz. Six out of six. Six out of seven. There we go. Good one, Grandpa. You're the best, Grandpa. You're the best. There we go. Now you're getting into the swing of things. Ah, oh, you fucking missed it. <laughs> Stupid grandpa. Let's get on with it. Oh! <laughs> Ow! Tear it all down! Bring it all down! And the time of <laughs> Lefty's just as crazy as the Leatherface family. Boys, boys, boys. You could have had a way better one-liner than boys, boys, boys. Never should have been doing this. That's way better. Good job. However, if I was you, I would jump down and go, Time to break the chain. Saw. Can't stand the heat. 
Get out of the damn kitchen, huh? <laughs> You realize you live in Texas. The whole place is a kitchen. I'm the Lord of the Harvest. Who's that? Some new health food bunch? Is there any money in it you want to know? <laughs> yeah, right here. How much? For the three chainsaws, I'll give you the price of three for the price of two. <laughs> oh no, he's going to bring it all down. Oh, that guy ain't going to shit right for months. <laughs> Chainsaw lights up behind you! I knew it! Luke, I never told you what happened to your father. Leatherface is your daddy. You guys realize these are actual functioning chainsaws and not just swords. Legit, Grandpa's getting flashbacks to when the first Star Wars released. Ah, looks... looks bad. Yeah, I mean, you got a chainsaw shoved up your ass, so it's probably gonna be bad. Ah. Holy shit, Leatherface has moves like Ben Kenobi. Ah. Doesn't this dude have two chainsaws? Use them. Become the Darth Maul of Texas. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Is Grandpa gonna kill the Phantom Menace? Sir Floy, the guy's just kicking right in the balls. <laughs> Is Drayden gonna blow himself? <laughs> oh my God. His accuracy is like embarrassing. <gasps> oh, crawl faster. Careful, his hand might be made of metal. Imagine if she just started punching him and just hear. <laughs> Ow. Oh, is that grandma? Holy fuck, grandma's seen better days. This guy's like the fucking Terminator, except he hasn't got as much muscle mass. He's got the metal forehead, literally won't die. That's the Terminator. Get it. You gotta admit, the design of the bone stuff they do is incredible. Incredible handiwork. Oh, that's not so good handwork. It's like dad's eating a cracker, isn't it? Huh? I guess, it depends how good the cracker is. Don't touch her! No! Grandma! No! Grandma! 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 Oh, oh my god, I thought she was alive. I was gonna say, fuck off, that bitch is alive. <laughs> Rip it harder! Twist it! Pop it! Stroke it! Stretch it! Oh. Oh my god, down the tube, down the tube, down the tube. <laughs> That's what Leatherface did at the end of the first one. If I had the chance to kill that guy with the metal head, right before he fell out, I would have gone, now this is what I call an iron deficiency. Bang! And then he rolls, he fucking rolls down a slide. It makes it a little bit more fun, doesn't it? Well, that was the end. <laughs> that was extremely different from the first one. <laughs> Enough. <laughs> You play that at the intro, not the end. <laughs> All right, so that was Texas Chainsaw Massacre Part 2, otherwise known as Texas Chainsaw Massacre 2. More chainsaws, more massacres. I'm going to burp. <clears throat> that was very different. Um, a lot easier to watch, honestly. It just wasn't as scary, and they tried to do it more as a comedy, which it works in aspects. I feel like that would work perfect as a dark comedy, which is what I think it was trying to do. I can see why people would like that and think it's just as good as the original. I think the original as a standalone movie is like almost perfect. I don't really know how I feel about it. Honestly, I don't. I feel kind of strange. Definitely dirty. Definitely perfect movie for Dirty January. Let me know what you think about Texas Chainsaw Massacre Part 2, actually. I... 
Yeah, I don't actually know. I think in terms of ratings, I'm going to give Texas Chainsaw Massacre 2 a 3.5 out of 5. It's definitely still Texas and Chainsaws. Yeah. I'm going to talk more about this movie in my Patreon after show podcast that I do, the PP podcast. Um, I'm going to read some of the fun facts and trivia. So if you're interested in that or you want to see my videos a whole day early or you want to make a movie request yourself, Patreon down below as well. Please leave a big like or a little like depending on your thumb size. Subscribe if you haven't already. I've got a ton more videos on the way. Ooh. Hold on my forehead. Honestly, now I think about it a little more, Drayton needs to stick one of these up his ass. Actually, that's a, never put something like this up your ass.